Hi everyone, I uh, just decided to do a video for a, a quick update about uh, what I'm uh, doing at this time. And uh, I did uh, put together this uh, particular motor as a test device. <clears throat> and this is what I've uh, come up with. So this is the original uh, motor uh, covers end. And actually it has uh, brushes on it and that's why I've uh, put it there. So I'll... Uh, zoom in there you can see the uh, brushes so here I am turning the shaft and you can see the commutators there and uh, I have a rotor there that <coughs> I've modified uh, I've actually I've got two of these motors so I've got another rotor uh, right here two identical rotors this one here I'm gonna keep uh, original unmodified uh, commutators which is like <coughs> removing the uh, every second commutator uh, to the coil the contact. So this one here, like I say, has been modified and that's probably why you can see the uh, soldering uh, that's happening there. And you can see the wires removed there. <clears throat> There's the wire removed and there it is. <clears throat> on and on and on. And then you can see this arcing that happens. Uh, basically that is the uh, flyback just uh, <laughs> doing that so uh, this thing is still, I'm still testing. I'm not uh, <coughs> going to come up with a conclusion at this time. And uh, I've been testing it just with one coil. And I have this other coil here ready to go. That just uh, can be mounted there. And it could be <coughs> changed in uh, timing like this just by twisting it from side to side. So that is uh, what's going on with uh, this particular model. And uh, in the next video, I'm going to cover uh, what I'm doing uh, with this here. And uh, this test device is something that I was working on. Now, keep in mind, this is not a Bedini uh, motor or anything like that. That's not what I'm doing. Uh, this is like a real motor. But I use this uh, configuration because it's, it's very easy to work with, uh, you know, to test, do experiments with. So, because you got a lot of room, so you can put a coil, you can put magnets, you can do all this. But the whole idea is I'm not building a wheel thing, I'm building a real motor. And the real motor will uh, come out from the results of these uh, tests done on this. So this is just my test rate for that. So in the next video, <coughs> I will do a uh, demo of what I'm working on at this time, which was uh, I was working on this about a month ago. And uh, I will show you the results. Uh, that I'm having now which are fairly uh, interesting as well and uh, could actually uh, help out those that are working uh, with uh, pulse motors as well because this could be a directly applied to that so it's used utilizing permanent magnets in a better configuration so that'll be the next video thanks bye